Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play this silly little song called Neo Sunglasses. It's by the same guy who uh, created that PPAP catchy song, the Pen Pineapple, Apple Pen song, okay, the Pico Taro guy, okay. So let's go ahead and show you how to play this Neo Sunglasses. There's a few parts, it's not as catchy as the PPAP but the bass line still has some like repetitive pattern that it's kind of catchy, okay? But anyway, let's go ahead and show you this first before we start learning it. So the bass line goes like this. It repeats over and over again. If you can't see it, it's one octave higher, it goes like this. Like that, okay? So I'll be teaching it. Okay, so it's really easy. Just find an octave D. If you can't do an octave, just do one D. It doesn't matter, okay? So octave D for three times. One, two, three. And then you hold that. And then on the fourth D, you play it again. And then the fifth D. And then after that, A. And then D. So there's only seven notes in this pattern, okay? And you repeat that. So it's like one, D, 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 A, D. Like that. Okay, so one more time, so it just goes like this. D, 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 A, D. D, 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 A, D. That's the rhythmic pattern as well. So it's like da, 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 like that. Okay, so da, 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 D, 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 A, D. Like that. Simple, right? Okay, so that's it for the repetitive pattern. I'm going to teach you also the um, middle part where it goes like this. I'll give you a preview. It's like the part where you kind of like, says something about like, oh, with the glasses and without the glasses, something like that. I'm not even sure. I watched the video, I'm not even entirely sure what this is about. But it goes like this. And then it repeats the pattern again. Like that. Okay, so I'll be teaching this part right now. So, right hand's super easy. It goes two Bs, two Cs, and then B flat B, and two Cs. And then B flat B, and then C C, two C's again, and then C C for the third time, and then B flat B, and then C F sharp, and then E F sharp, like that. That's the right hand, okay? So one more time. So it goes two B's, two C's, B flat B, two C's, B flat B, two C's, two C's for the second time, two C's for the third time, and then B flat B, and then C F sharp, and then E F sharp. Like that. Left hand super easy, just play the D major chord, which is D, F sharp, A. Okay, so with the two hands together for this part, it goes together. And after that, it just follows that um, pattern I taught you before. On the left hand by itself. Okay, and that's it. Okay, so one more time. So it just goes. The final part of the song is really easy as well. I'll just give you a preview. It just goes like this. It's like a da 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 That part where it goes like this. And then repeats that. Like that. Okay, so the right hand is the harder part because um, it's fast, but it's really repetitive. It goes like this. This, this four note motive repeated for seven times. So it goes two F sharps, an F and an F sharp. That's the four note motive. So it's like, F sharp, F sharp, F, F sharp. See? And then you repeat that for a total of seven times. So second time, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seven. And on after the seven, on the eight time it's different, it goes two F sharps and down to middle C and D. Like that. Just like that for the right hand. Okay, one more time. So the four note motive, play for seven times. One, two, three. Oh, it's hard to count and say it at the same time. My bad. So count on your head. So I'll maybe I'll just do like Da, 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 like that. Okay, so <laughs> it was hard for me to say out loud the number and play at the same time, but you get the point, right? So seven times with that four note motive, and then on the eighth time, it's different. It goes F sharp, F sharp, C, D, and that's it. Okay, left hand once again is just D major, and uh, yeah, and you hold that chord with the first note. So it goes three. Uh, keep doing it with it like I said. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, keep on doing that. Okay, so I'll just blindly count in my head, okay, so... And last time goes... And 
off of that, just the... Okay, so that's pretty much it, okay? So, remember to count in your head. If you count out loud like me, I, like, I can't, I'll stuff up because it's actually hard to count out loud and play this motif at the same time as well, so... play it seven times like that okay because it's fast and it's kind of like hard to count out loud with it just count it in your head whether the times when you're playing the four note motor over and over again but anyway that's pretty much it that's actually the whole song okay so i hope you enjoyed learning this pretty like catchy yet annoying theme well it's not as catchy as the ppap i love the ppap a lot i play that song as well go ahead and check that out if you want and check out the cover for this neo sunglasses that i did as well i made it my own version of it and i also taught the ppap as well the ppap is a lot more fun and more catchy to learn but anyway enjoy your time on my channel and see you next time Hello guys, as a reward for watching my video right to the end, here is what I have for you. If you want to learn how I can play any song in the world including this one in this video within 10 to 20 minutes just by listening, then click the first link in the description below to preview my ear mastery book for free. Click the second link for my beginner's course if you are completely new to the piano and don't know where to start. Click the third link for my library of popular full song video lessons membership or click the fourth link for my paid piano request and full song tutorial service if you want me to personally play any song for you or make a full song tutorial for you. And finally, if you are a sheet music learner who wants to learn a specific song or arrangement where the sheet music is not available anywhere in the world, then click the fifth link for my sheet music transcription service where I will personally write it out for you. As for now, like this video, subscribe, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.